Here in the locker room with Rontez Miles. Rontez, another year goes by. Yeah. How fast does it go? Man, speed of lightning, man. Um, this is year six for me, and um, at this point, it's like it gets faster each year. The older you get, it gets faster, and um, we here. It's already over, so year six, so hopefully year seven comes. You know, it's a blessing to be in this league this long, and um, just looking forward to what's, what's happening next. Special teams a big asset for the team this year. Is this the best unit that you've been a part of? Oh, there we go. So this is what I did. This is the best unit I've been a part of. And we had talented units, but this unit bought into the coaching. Coach Boyer played for a long time, played teams a long time, and knows what he's talking about. And he got the, night, the right personnel in here to follow and, you know, perfect what he's teaching. And um, so I took a helmet, as you see, number one special team unit, 2018. And I got all the guys that contribute this year on teams to sign. Even got my Dre Roberts jersey down there, you know, so. <laughs> Yeah. Well, what made this unit the best one that you've been a part of? Um, like I said, you got the personnel. They brought the right people in, and um, you got guys. And let's let's be real. There's some guys that don't care too much for special teams. All of us came from starting roles in college and high school, but um, at this level, you got to play your role. Yeah. And if you're a role player in teams, it's very important. But it's important to have guys that want to do it. And um, we had a lot of guys that wanted to play, that wanted to win on teams, and that made it the best. What's the best thing for you about special teams? Because it's a different mindset that I don't think people realize. Oh, man, special teams is just all about want to and uh, just, just dogness. And at that point in the game in defense, you got to think more and more checks, more calm, patient. Special teams, just let it go. You go play fast, and it's one-on-one. -on -one. You usually match up with one person, and it tests your manhood. Is you going to let him beat you or not? You know what I mean? So it's one of those... Man, man, parts of the game that I love about it. That's, that, it makes football football still. You know, football is getting softer, in my opinion. But uh, special teams is still there. You still got that aggressiveness there. How nice is it for you? A couple years ago, Coach Boyer comes in here. He has a mission. He has a vision for this unit, and I think this is the year that it finally came together. Oh, that's amazing. I remember him coming in and hearing his ideas, and even talking about, I remember when Tyree Kill was in college, he was like, man, I like Tyree Kill. And I'm like, man, let me check him out. But just to come see him now, he's one of the top yeah. players, period, in the NFL, not even special teams. And um, he's a guy that knows his stuff, man. And it's amazing. He's the reason why I'm as good as I am. And when he came in, he told me to see my film. I feel like I've been out of position, playing the slot and other stuff. He put me in positions to make tackles and make plays. So he, he knows, man, and he knows his personnel very well. So it's big for him to get all the success and the accomplishment he made this year from uh, all the work he put in, man, he deserves it. You said it was year six for you. You've been a special teamer, a core guy. Mm -hmm. How do you keep getting better? Oh, man, uh, at this point, everybody can run, jump, tackle, hit. And the older you get, the faster the younger guys get, though. But it's your mental preparation, man. And um, that's what I learned over these years, becoming more of a pro, even for defense. And you just got to mentally know your job, know, know your opponent, and uh, it'll take you forward. So mentally, I just get better. Great. Thanks, Ron Thank you.